So I'm going to teach you guys how to use Final Cut Pro. Um, I'm going to be remaking one of my old edits and I'm going to try to keep keep it pretty simple and show you guys some effects but um if I'm not used to like editing and talking to myself so if I like stop talking <laughs> I'm sorry uh, hopefully this is not too awkward so yeah let's get started so I'm just opening Final Cut Pro and I think there's a link where you got where you can like download this for free so I'll put this in the description oh and this is an edit I made yesterday Okay, so I'm gonna be making one of my old edits. So to get this clear, you can like just delete it, or you can um, new and then project, and then okay. So so okay, this is, these are the clips that I'm gonna be using, and. I can upload this onto my YouTube if you guys want. Just give give this video a thumbs up. I don't remember where I got this. Someone sent me the link, but it wasn't on YouTube. Oh, and if you guys want to download a YouTube video, this is what you do. So, go to YouTube. Um, one Direction. Uh, night Changes. Uh, copy the link and then um, go to convert to mp3.net and you paste the link and then you go to mp4 and you can either get it uh, 720 or 1080 I like um, 1080 and then convert and sometimes it won't work so you have to go to 720 and then you just download it, and then I'll start downloading, and you drag it and just put it over here. But I already have it, so I'm not going to download it again. So that's what you would do if you want to download a YouTube video. And if you want to download a song, you would do the same. Just copy the link, and then bring it to this website, and paste it. And then download it, and it would go, it would go into your um, iTunes. So yeah. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so you have your clip, and then you'll just highlight what you want. That's good enough. Bring it down. I'm gonna zoom in. Take down. Bring down the the sound. Now I get my song. Um, you go to here to library and go to iTunes. And you get your song. Bad. Have it. I'm gonna zoom out because I need to get the place that I want. So. What you can do also is um right here. Blade. Blade it. Uh, I'll press A to go back to normal, select it, and delete. Bring it back to the beginning. That's right on it. Okay, so, and a shortcut to not be doing that, to be uh, bringing over here, press B. It tells you on the keyboard, it tells you right there all these. So I just press B on the keyboard, and if it's a blade to split it. <clears throat> then um A to bring it back to the normal. Delete. Bring this back. You know I was shy. Okay, so I just need to trim it right here a little. You know I was Zoom in just a bit. You know You 
and Vine, if you're uploading this to Vine, uh, the time is uh, 6 was 12. So, trim around here, delete, delete this, and then, you know I was shy. Oh, so that's 6.15, so bring it to 6. Sometimes, okay, I usually go uh, with 6.13, but I'm pretty sure it's 6.12, but let's just leave it there. So anyways, this is uh, this is what I'm going to do. So, you know I was shy. Uh, okay, so right here, these are cool effects. That you can put. Hold up, let me see what I want to do next. You know I was shy. You know I was shy. Can I like trim that? And also, if you highlight it um, and go right here, you can custom the speed. So 150. You know I was shy. Because it's playing really slow. So let me just. You know I was shy. That's what I want. You know I was shy. There we go. You know I was shy. Okay, so I like using this circle one a lot. Oh wait, I kind of need another. I need another part over here. But um. So, okay, so we'll have Zane. So I just put Zane down and take down the volume again. And then I'll add the little wait for some to see. You know I was shy. Okay, too slow. So let me speed this up. Let me see. Can I do? You know I was shy. Perfect. Okay, so now we we'll just drag the circle in the middle right here. I usually try to get as small as I can. Let me zoom in. Okay. So I bring this to this. To a little thing right there. And over here. Okay, so this is how it looks. I don't like that. I like, um, I usually go right here on the edge. Then bring it down and solid color. And I do it white. You can do it any color you want, but I like it white. So white, and then yeah. Okay, so this is how it's gonna look like. No, I was shy. Yeah, I like that, but it's really slow, so I'll make it a little bit smaller. If I go faster. Let's see. Yeah, it's better. So then we move on to Louie. And once again, it's probably going to be really slow, so I'm going to speed it up. You can go right here. Just That's a faster way of doing it instead of typing the numbers. Bring down the volume. Check this out. You know I was shy. And then we can do Harry. I mean, you can do it however you want, but I'm trying to keep it simple. Okay, and 
These are other cool effects. Go. You can add like the back TV on this one. With the back TV, you can. There's a lot of things I guess you can do. Um, you can roll it. The amount you want it. Let's just go with uh, yeah that much. Uh, there's a lot of different stuff you can do. Let's just keep it like that. Okay, and then. Sorry, my computer's really slow today. I need to delete stuff. And then we have Nile, or we can uh, do Liam on the Piata. Where's that at? So bring down the noise. You know I was shy. <laughs> My computer is everything all down. Okay, so this is where it starts getting hard because this is where you like have to like be trimming stuff to where you can fit it in the time zone that it has to be. And then we have Nile up in here. Lastly. Right there. Okay, the Louis part looks a little bit different. I'm just showing the Louis part. Speed this up. My computer's overheating. Uh, how cool is that? Okay, there we go. Let me just trim a little bit more. And if you want to add like more effects, you can. Let's do some other cool ones. This is pretty. This is a cool one. Wait, why is it loading? Oh, it's rendering. It needs to get all this shit together. Okay. So here we go. Let's just put that in there. Um. Oh. Mm, no, thank you. Oh, I'm missing one more thing. Okay, so Logos. Okay, let me just move it. There we go. Let me bring. Blade. Oh, I'm gonna blade it up. I guess. Just right there, and then highlight, delete, and let's see here. You know oh, let me bring this back. You know I was shy. Maybe a little bit longer. Okay. You know I was shy. And to change the color, let's see if I remember this. I had a time. I had a hard time changing the color for this. I. No, not info. Uh, la, la. Oh, over here. Show color board. Yeah, there we go. Is that where I want? Oh, here. Go up. I want. I like it white. Okay, so. 
So that's how to make like a simple edit, you know, and at the end, I had the hardest time learning how to do this. At the end, to send it to yourself, you have to, to Apple device, and do it to this one. Okay, and you need to go to settings first. So settings. And you want to make sure down here, uh, you have it to message. So you text it to yourself. Um, the highest quality. And then next. And save it as a project that you want. Let me just put a couple other numbers. Blah, blah, blah. And it's gonna, um, when it's at 100, it's gonna do it. Oh, wait, I totally forgot, like, one of the most important things you guys have been asking me, how to do the flashes. Okay, the flashes are so, so easy. Wait, what am I doing? Okay, so the flashes, you come over here, you just get white, you bring it over here. Close up, um... Pop this open one more time. Close. Um. Okay, you go to over here and then uh, bright white. Once again, you press um, B on your keyboard to to slice it, to blade it, I guess. And you just, as small as you can. And then, A to bring, it, to bring it back to normal, delete. And then you zoom in. You zoom in, click this, and copy it, and then, so, you bring it to where, you, it's command and C. To copy something is command, See if you have a Mac, and then to um to paste, it's Command and then V. So, so yeah, that's how I do my flashes. It's not like nothing fancy, and you can either get the like, the black paper or whatever, and you just um, line it up with the beads. But I'm not actually doing that right now. So this is how it would look like. And you can add like more flashes if you want. I just, yeah. <laughs> okay. You know I was shy. And like I said, you would just send it over here. Um, device, Apple device. Make sure it's a message, and then next day, and whatever, and yeah, and then it would it would send to your phone, and and you would just save it, and then use Square Video to upload it, and hopefully this helped you because when I first got Final Cut Pro, it was so complicated, so at least you know some of the basic stuff now, and so yeah. If you want me to upload this video, like the the take me home um opening thing, give this video a thumbs up, and if it gets over two hundred thumbs up, I'll upload it on my uh, YouTube channel. So yeah, thank you for watching, and bye.